G'day guys, welcome to today's vlog. I had to get out some sales today. But before I do that, I have to head down to the shop and get some supplies for the eBay business and stuff. I just need a few items to keep me going. So I'm gonna go down and get that stuff right now and then I'll show you guys what's sold today. Okay, so we got what we needed to get. Now let's get these sales out. What are we sold here? All right, item number one. So they want express post, some Subi jeans. Nothing special here, 27 bucks I sold them for. They were the Subi DD, D double E, D double E's. And the code for those is... So they're already packaged up and everything, but these ones right here. Then we also sold some G-Star Raw Attack Low Straight Dark Blue Jeans. We sold those. What did we get for those? So they were these jeans right here. And we ended up getting 35 bucks for those. Next up we sold a Nalini sort of like skin suit, like a one-piece cycling lycra spandex skin suit for 35 bucks. And it, and it is this one right here. It's actually a women's one, size one. So uh, yeah, that one's going out for 35. So some of the items that I have sold that I'm showing you guys at the moment sold for probably a lot less than what I could have really gotten for them. Only because I've recently just put up a sale on my eBay store because I kind of want to get rid of most of my inventory that's sort of here in my office so then I don't have to rely on my mum to send it out whenever I sell stuff because I want to keep it easy on her because when I leave for van life in the future, whenever that may be, in the, you know, next few weeks maybe, I'm hoping it's, I'm hoping it's going to be that near. But maybe another month. I'm not 100% sure when I'm leaving. It just all depends when the van is set and ready to go. But having that said, I just want to make sure that I have, you know, not that much stuff for my mum to send out. And instead, when I'm on the road, I want to be sourcing. And then also selling stuff. Preferably sourcing items that are going to sell quicker. So I don't have to hold on to them as long and probably selling them at a little lower price. And I can get them out the door a bit quicker. But yeah, so I just put on a sale on my store just so I can sell some stuff. And um, as a result of that, I sold this um, men's Paul and Shark polo shirt, a long sleeve polo shirt. Let me show you guys. It is this one. I already have it pre-packaged, so I'll just show you guys on the screen here. So it was this one right here, just a long sleeve polo shirt, Paul and Shark. We got only 28 bucks for this one. This one right here. On sale, we also sold this Nerf here. The Nerf Retaliator for 28 bucks for this one. It's not complete, doesn't have the magazine or the extensions or anything like that. But uh, yeah, I guess that's pretty good. No, sorry, 22 bucks. That's right, I normally sell these for like 30 or so, but considering it was on sale, we got 22. Then we also sold some jeans as well, some nudie jeans. I think I got full price. I may have taken an offer on these ones actually. They are these ones right here, the Nudie Thin Fins in a size 33. We ended up getting 50 bucks for these. All right, we got those packages. Now I think we have subscriber mail. I believe it says from Tom. And I think it is Tom that has sent the metal detector. I believe he said he was going to send through the manual, so I'm thinking this is the manual for the metal detector, but let's open it up and see. Walk into IGA, turn left straight away, and then keep walking straight, and you'll see them on. Okay, so before I open up this, I've got to go down and get Shania some vegan cookies. Because I like them too. <laughs> Watching friends, eh? Okay, so let's open this up to Cody from Tom. Again, if you guys want to send me any stuff, send it at P.O. Box 87, Bunyip, Victoria, 3815. So it's definitely some kind of paper. Ah, uh, yes. Metal detector, owner's manual. There we go. Thank you, Tom. I'm gonna give this a read. 
Because what I'm thinking, when I head off in my van, I'm probably going to take the metal detector with me and just store it in the van for when I go to beaches because I have plans to just freaking camp in awesome freaking places. I just want to connect with Mother Nature and just get that awesomeness of Mother Nature. That light is really bright out there. But anyway, kind of all lopsided. But essentially, I just want to get that connect with Mother Nature. Just live right next to the beach. Live in freaking forests. Just do awesome, adventurous stuff in the van. So this would be pretty cool because I'm, you know, planning to go to some beaches and stuff. So I'll take it with me for sure. And uh, I'll do some research and read about this metal detector. If you guys haven't seen the metal detector video that Tom sent, he sent me a metal detector, which is freaking insanely awesome. Check out that video if I remember. I'll put a link down below or try and link it on the screen if I remember. I'll probably just have the link down below. So check out that video if you haven't already. And thanks again, Tom. So guys, today's been one of those not so entertaining vlogs. I've spent most of the day just doing gardening and cleaning up the backyard. So I haven't, I uh, didn't really want to share it because it's boring. It's kind of why I just want to get the van and hit the road because every day is a new day, a new adventure. It's just going to be awesome to vlog. Something like this is just completely boring, so I didn't really want to share it with you guys, but I cleaned up all along here. So all along here, it's pretty filthy, um, but now it's like a reasonable garden area where I might plant some veggies and stuff like that. Cleaned up all around here. It's really, really dark, so it's a, difficult for the camera to pick up. Done a bit over there as well. But she's out of focus. I put all of the stuff that's just crap in one big pile. So we can try and get rid of it. But that is it for today's vlog, guys. Thanks for watching. Give us a thumbs up. Drop some comments below as well. See you guys in hopefully a much more entertaining vlog tomorrow. Probably not because I'm doing the same stuff tomorrow with a mobile lawns. I just went down and got some petrol for the mower. So I'm going to do that tomorrow. But thanks again, guys. See you later.